do me a favor, uh, just say and spell your name for me. Uh, my name is Spider Webb, S-P-I-D-E-R-W-E-B-B. -B. Okay, and uh, your group? Uh, uh, the name of our organization is Single Subject uh, Amendment. All right, and now tell me a little bit about this. Why, why is this bill important here in Florida, and, and really what are you aiming to do? Uh, the Single Subject Amendment or the Delegates Bill? So, single Subject Amendment. Um, our mission is to add an amendment to the United States Constitution uh, that would provide a single subject title provision that's in 41 state constitutions, but it's missing in the United States Constitution. And the language would uh, read something to the effect, Congress shall pass no bill and no bill shall become law which embraces more than one subject. That subject would be clearly expressed in the bill's title. So uh, essentially what would happen uh, riders, by definition, by definition, riders are unrelated provisions, um, and so the effect of uh, the the, op the adoption of this uh, amendment to the United States Constitution would be to constitutionally prohibit riders, and riders are used um, harmfully um, in one of two ways in Congress. Um, you have a piece of legislation that's going to pass; it must pass; uh, it has to pass and uh, riders are added by um, uh, those in power to reward uh, loyalty, to uh, uh, reward for votes on other measures. Um, uh, even more harmful way, you have a piece of legislation that um, uh, by a sponsor, a sponsor has a piece of legislation that uh, uh, just doesn't have the votes. It's close, but it just doesn't have the votes. It cannot pass on its own merits. But the sponsor will go to uh, his members of Congress, uh, his fellow members of Congress, uh, asking for their support. So it'll go something like this. I need your support. The member says, I can't support your measure. The sponsor says, I need your vote. What will it take? So you get enough bridges to nowhere um, added to a piece of legislation, collect enough votes, and now you have a piece of legislation that passed, uh, that passes Congress, no part of which could have passed on its own merits. Now this is in 41 state constitutions, uh, limiting those state legislatures to um, a single subject title provision, so this would add the same provision to um, similar provision to the United States Constitution. Now, uh, a constitutional conference, uh, it, that's called an Article 5 convention. Right. People and say that's coming. Yes, it is coming. And um, there's only two ways to amend the Constitution. That's covered by Article 5 of the United States Constitution. And um, amending the Constitution is a two-step two -step process. Um, the first process is getting a proposed amendment. And then the second step is the ratification process. Uh, under Article 5, there's only two ways to amend the United States Constitution. Congress, by joint resolution adopted by a two-thirds vote of both houses, can propose an amendment to the United States Constitution. The only other way um, is by an Article 5 convention. And the way that works, the framers of our uh, Constitution in 1787 provided two ways to propose amendments one way by Congress, but the other way if Congress perhaps wouldn't act on something that they should act on. So if two-thirds of the state legislatures make an application for an Article 5 convention, then Congress must convene an Article 5 convention, which is a convention of the states. And they have the power, their delegates, uh, the state's delegates, then have the power to propose an amendment to the United States Constitution. And then, um, uh, and then the ratification process takes over, regardless of whether the proposal was by Congress or the proposal was by an Article 5 convention, the ratification process takes over. And Congress controls that. They make the decision as to whether or not ratification would be by three-fourths of the state legislatures or three-fourths of state conventions. But in the history of our country, um, of the 27 amendments which have been adopted, um, uh, uh, 26 were by state legislature ratification rather than the one uh, state convention ratification. This sounds like Articles of Confederation stuff. Well, now remember, Articles of Confederation were the, uh, was the supreme law of the land uh, for um, 
what, six or seven years, something like that, and was uh, replaced by the United States Constitution, having been ratified by all 13 states. Um, and so this really, the bill about the constitutional, uh, the bill would really just, what, set parameters on how Florida Yes, the, the delegates bill, um, that's a common name for it, uh, would be the mechanism for any state, for Florida, uh, with respect to Florida, would be the method by which Florida, the Florida legislature, would uh, select delegates and alternate delegates, and uh, which, uh, and this bill provides for, you know, the instructions that they would receive, the oath that they would be required to abide by, and, um, and criminal penalties if they didn't, because this would be serious matters. And how serious are we talking about? Well, amending the United States Constitution, which has only been amended 27 times in the history of our country, our, our document is, is um, an amazing document, as everybody can attest. And, you know, we have the separation of powers, uh, which is the foundation of our uh, United States Constitution, uh, three branches of government, but a um, never used before provision is um, is Article 5, which provides the mechanism by which uh, uh, the, um, the Constitution can be amended. And it's, uh, it's brilliant, it's genius. Uh, Congress can um, propose amendments if they feel it's necessary, uh, but, um, but the states can uh, propose an amendment also if Congress perhaps would not act on something perhaps they should act on. And our proposal, a single subject title provision, would be something that would be, uh, would be very unlikely that Congress would uh, propose that amendment. We'll get a member of Congress to introduce a joint resolution proposing an amendment uh, to the Constitution to provide a single subject title provision, but it never see the light of day. So the Article 5 Convention is the route that must be taken to um, uh, add that important provision. It's a, uh, upon adoption, it would have a profound and positive effect on the way Congress conducts its business and, and the method by which it enacts its, 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 the laws of the land. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Appreciate it.